the most widely consumed green tea in Japan. Raw sakura shrimp rarely available anywhere else. Mountains and the sea. In Oegawa Shizuoka, I had my fill of tasty food and scenic views. First, I went to a small railway station built above a lake. This grand view received the Cool Japan Award from a non-Japanese jury. The surrounding hills change color seasonally. In autumn, they are aflame with color. Shizuoka is the top green tea producer in Japan, and Oigawa leads the production. Tea picking experience was great fun. Only the young leaves are harvested, and they are steamed and dried. While enjoying the view of a terraced tea plantation, I had a cup of freshly brewed green tea. It was the ultimate tea experience. Viewing terrace tea salons like this are scattered in the area. That night, I stayed at a farmhouse inn. I wanted to experience traditional country life in Japan. The dinner was rich with local ingredients, including colorful sushi made with fresh vegetables. In this region, tea is not only for drinking, for example, freshly picked leaves can be battered and deep fried to make tempura. Rakani is salty sweet braised peanuts that have been long loved by the locals. It is a perfect snack to go with tea. The next day, I went to Suruga Bay to see a fish market. The auction was brisk and lively as buyers competed with bids to win tuna. For lunch, I had rich seafood from Suruga Bay, including some tuna like I saw at the market, and beautiful sakura shrimp. They can only be caught in Suruga Bay. Trying them raw, the sweetness spread in my mouth. Others deep fried in batter were quite delicious with a savory smell. At the end of my journey, I visited a local market. It was full of local specialities. I bought Japanese sweets made with green tea as souvenirs. Come visit and enjoy Oigawa Shizuoka!